Welcome, and thank you for attending this special Take 10 presentation. I'm Stephanie Schmoody, your host for the next 10 minutes as we explore our Antarctic cruise adventure, one of our most popular journeys. Since 1991, ANK has been curating and delivering unique and enrichment-focused expeditions worldwide. Over the years, without question, the hallmark of our ANK programs and what brings our guests back time and time again is the value of the expedition team and our education program. Each departure focuses comprehensively on a wide base of key enrichment experiences that we have identified as crucial to the experience, including the range of wildlife, geology, history, photography, and environmental and climate ecology. While we have been operating in the Antarctic for more than 30 years, since 2006, each season we focus one of our Antarctica voyages on the dynamics and impacts of how the environments of the polar regions, and in particular in the Southern Ocean, are having a dramatic impact on our entire global environments and ecosystems. There is not an area on the planet that has more dramatic changes over the past several decades than Antarctica, and in particular, the region surrounding the Antarctic Peninsula. On this voyage, while our guests will enjoy the full experience of Antarctica, we will have a special focus during our education and enrichment program on the impacts of climate change. You will be in the company of some of the world's foremost experts on this topic and have a firsthand view at what the scientists and researchers are studying and learning, particularly in the marine environments. We will begin our journey in Buenos Aires for two nights with time to relax and explore the city, then take an exclusive charter flight to Ushuaia where we will board our fully chartered luxury expedition vessel for a total of 10 nights exploring the stunning Antarctic Peninsula. Now I mentioned for this voyage, you will be accompanied by some of the world's foremost experts in the areas of marine biology, history, ornithology, photography, but most important in climate and geological sciences. Our world-class core team of field naturalists, zodiac drivers, and lecturers will be joined by Dr. James McClintock, who is the NSF Endowed Professor of Marine Sciences and Microbiology at the University of Alabama, Birmingham, author of a number of best-selling books on the topic, sought after speaker, and has nearly 30 years of working research experience in the Antarctic Peninsula. Jim has worked with ANK since 2006 and each year leads our guests for a special behind the scenes tour at the U.S. Palmer Station, which is the base of Jim's long term ecological research project. While Jim's focus is on the marine environments, we will have on board a full and comprehensive expedition team led by one of the industry's most experienced expedition leaders, Dr. Marco Favero. Every expedition has its key highlights and elements. So today I wanted to take 10 to highlight what we feel are the most compelling for this Antarctic expedition. It all starts with the penguins. One of the amazing aspects of Antarctica is not only the variety of wildlife, but the sheer volume. Perhaps unlike anywhere on earth, the wildlife here are completely unaffected by our presence. Why is this? because on land they have no natural predation, so there is not a natural or innate fear. This is why as operators, we observe a very strict code of conduct, which includes specific and managed distances that we are to stay away from the wildlife. During our time in the peninsula, we hope to see a variety of species. One of the other interesting things that you will learn is how the changes in climate have had very different impacts on the various species. For example, nesting areas have changed. Penguins need a relatively dry area for their nests, so in places where the humidity levels have rapidly changed and where snow amounts have increased, this has had a big impact on the nesting sites. This is particularly the case with the chinstrap penguins you see on the left. Also, changes in the marine environments that have had an impact on food sources has played a major role in the declining populations of the Adelie penguins that you see porpoising in the bottom right. The most populous species we encounter are the gentoos, the guys with the white patch, and if we are lucky, we will have a chance to also see the rockhoppers. The most amazing marine mammal encounters in the world happen right here in Antarctica. Throughout the course of the voyage, we hope to have multiple opportunities to see a wide variety of seal species, including fur seals, weddell seals, and crab eater seals, as well as amazing whale experiences, often when we're out in the zodiacs for up close and personal encounters. I mentioned before the impacts of food sources in the marine environment. It all starts with the krill. Small crustaceans, once in plentiful supply, 
that have diminished due to a relative rise in water temperatures as well as salinity levels. The krill are the building blocks of the food chain supply, so this has had impacts on all of the species, including the humpback whales. If we are lucky, however, we will have the chance to witness bubble net feeding, which you see in this image in the top right, where the whales blow a curtain of air bubbles from deep below the surface, forcing the krill into a cone and come up with mouths agape, capturing millions as they eat. This is one of nature's most awesome spectacles. But the changes in Antarctica are not only in the marine environments. There is an ever-changing landscape that in many ways has become more and more mesmerizing. Antarctica is also a photographer's dream, which is why on each and every voyage we lead, we have our own onboard photo coach to give our guests tips and tutorial in order to get the best out of their photography. The continent has also had a very active geological history as well. One of the places we hope to visit is Deception Island, where conditions permitting, we sail the vessel right into the caldera of the volcano and led by our geology team, trek to the top at Teflon Bay. Conditions permitting, one of the highlights of our journey will be our planned visit to the U.S. Palmer Station on Anvers Island. This is one of the U.S. Antarctic Program's active stations and has been the home of a number of research scientists, including our own Dr. McClintock's long-term ecological research program. Since 2006, ANK and ANK Philanthropy has partnered with Dr. McClintock, and we have delivered over $300,000 of equipment and in-kind funding. Among the equipment gifts we have presented include satellite penguin tags, high-definition underwater camera equipment, and we installed Antarctica's only penguin webcam still in use near the station. Our visit is by special permit, but conditions permitting, we have the opportunity to be led by Jim and his staff for a behind-the-scenes tour and opportunity to meet and learn from the scientists and researchers here. Now that you have seen some of the rugged, remote, and beautiful environments that we will visit in Antarctica, I wanted to close by reminding you that you will be experiencing this in absolute comfort and style. For ANK's Antarctica expeditions, we exclusively charter one of the world's premier polar expedition vessels. A few key things that I want to highlight. As with all of ANK's luxury expedition cruise programs, ANK has full expedition and operational control of the program. Part of that operational control enables us to set and manage our own capacity, which for this program would be no more than 199 guests. And in fact, when you take into account the number of solo travelers we typically have, plus the additional space we need for our amazing expedition team, we typically travel with even less. This is on a ship that is designed to carry 244 passengers. So what this means for our guests is that we will never have more people on board than approximately 70% of what the ship is designed to carry, which means much more comfort and personal space. With the combination of our expedition team and the ship's crew, we have nearly a one-to-one -one service personnel to guest ratio on board, providing a greatly enhanced level of personal service. 100% of our passenger accommodations have a full private balcony to enjoy, in solitude if you wish, the amazing environment, including the potential for incredible wildlife sightings right in front of you. As always, all ANK luxury expedition cruises are all inclusive, including butler service in all suite categories, all gratuities for staff and crew, the highest level of cuisine with multiple dining options, 24 hour room service, ANK travelers valet laundry service, open bar, all excursions, a complimentary parka, water bottle, and waterproof backpack, all ground services, and so much more. Also, you have the opportunity to extend your journey with exceptional group pre and post extensions. Begin your journey with a pre-cruise extension to the majestic Iguazu Falls, including time on both the Brazilian as well as the Argentina side of the falls, or you may choose to extend your time in Ushuaia for a three-day extension in Tierra del Fuego. We look forward to welcoming all of our travelers and in particular, don't miss this opportunity to join our team for ANK's epic Antarctic adventure. Please visit our website to take a look at our luxury expedition cruise portfolio this year. To reserve your place on this or any of our luxury expedition cruises, please call ANK or contact your travel advisor. Thank you for tuning in.